Hey guys, you're watching Dansky, the place to be to develop your creative skills and in this tutorial, it's not gonna be a five second one, it's gonna hopefully be a few minutes. There's something in Adobe XD, if you use Auto Animate as well, that I just have to share with you. It's like essential. So we're gonna jump to the screen now and I'm gonna show you this quick tip that you must absolutely know. Okie dokie, so you can see I'm now in XD. I've got two artboards, I've named them one and two. I've got a circle on this artboard here and I'm just gonna double click this and in the layers panel on the left, I'm just going to type circle. It doesn't matter what name you give it. Next, I'm gonna select this circle and I'm gonna copy and paste this over to here. So what this is, is in Adobe XD, if you want to auto animate something and have it fade in from like outside of the artboard, as soon as you move your shape or your layer outside the artboard, it moves it onto the pasteboard. The pasteboard is this big gray area around the edge. It's not an artboard. You can't link to it or auto animate to or from it. So if we're gonna auto animate, it has to be from one artboard to another one. But how do we move something, an object or a layer outside of the artboard, but still have it be on that artboard? Well, I'm gonna show you now. Okie dokie, so if I click on this one here, for example, on artboard one, I want this to start on the outside and then just animate in like this to artboard two and then slide out again. But you can see, as soon as I drag this circle outside of the artboard and let go, if I go up here in the layers panel, you can see it's now on the pasteboard. And as I mentioned, that's no good. We can't work with that. So let's just undo that. We'll switch over to prototype mode. Just select one of the artboards and I'm gonna click the tab, link these together, and I'm gonna link them together with an auto animate. So you can use any trigger you like. I'm just gonna stick with time. But as long as you set up an auto animate, Adobe XD will be like, ah, oh, Okay, they've linked these artboards together. They clearly don't want to move that object onto the pasteboard. So once you've set up an auto animate, anything I click and drag out here, you can see in the layers panel, it's still part of artboard number one. So now I could maybe reduce the opacity of this and click play and you can see it fades in and doesn't do anything else because I didn't link it back to fade out. But yeah, that's a super quick tip. That is how you can move objects or layers outside of an artboard, but still have them technically be on that artboard. All in XD, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this super quick tutorial. If you do have any questions or comments, you know what to do, drop those down below. But as always, like this video if you enjoyed it. Take care and I'll see you next time.